invited to something like that. Because they don't invite losers. You have to be special. I am special. Oh, when I started, where's the station? Oh, good evening. Hello. I can't stop. I'm late. I'm late. I'm really, really, really late, late. I'm so late, I'm really late. Well, can we help? <laughs> I'm late for the Queen's birthday party. How are you going to help me with that? Well, the station's just over there, mate. Thank you very much. <laughs> You won't get in without this. Well, come on, guys. You wanted something to happen. Keeps it out of sight. You're very good, but I don't carry cash. Oh, on the sidewalk, one sunny morning, lies a body just oozing light, and someone sneaking around the corner. First up, we thought, get her to make a film so that you know what she does. And we thought, go to Thailand, because it's second only to Florida at the moment as the UK's favourite long-haul destination. 700,000 Brits will go there this year. So we said, OK, three hotels. Show us the difference. Show us what you do. There's no shortage of places to stay in Bangkok, from backpacker hostels to five-star deluxe. However, we've asked our inspector to take a look at three of the best-known international brands, none of whom are aware that she's working for the Holiday Hit Squad, the Sheraton, the Marriott, and to kick things off, the real Bangkok Hilton. Oh, wow. Look at this. What a fantastic view. And the good thing about this hotel is every single room has a fantastic view. But that's not always the case, so if you want a view, ask for it when you check in. First impressions of the hotel room, I really like it. It's got a really nice sense of place. I know I'm in Thailand, but it's sort of modern and contemporary at the same time. They've shown restraint, and that means it feels so much more welcoming and much more stylish. It's really nice. I really like the bathroom too. It's a really good size, it's really spacious, it's got a nice cool neutral colour scheme. It's got a really big separate shower and some nice modern design touches. This hotel just really continues to impress me. I mean, it's just a fantastic display in there for breakfast. Really good value for eight pounds. Far from being hell on earth, as well as a smart spa, the real-life Bangkok Hilton has, get this, a fake beach on the fourth floor. When I think of a Hilton, I think of trouser presses and meeting rooms, and that's certainly not the case here. Look at this fabulous swimming pool. If you get a lounger over by the edge, you can look down on what's happening at the river, or you can be pretty cool in Miami back on the sand. It's absolutely fabulous, really good fun. 